guys <laughs> hi guys how are you guys i'm just literally feeling myself you guys will not believe that yesterday i was being checked <laughs> what's the word i'm going to use i was being razzled <laughs> and i have to tell the guy like excuse me married with two children <laughs> you guys look at me <laughs> i did my own for where I did, they do grocery shopping. Not really necessarily even grocery shopping. Just a few things I really just wanted to pick out at the mall yesterday on my way back from work. And at my back, I kept saying, oh, young lady, excuse me. Young lady, excuse me. The way I turned, <laughs> the way I turned with my ring on my finger, you guys know that I never even take out my ring from my finger. I sleep with it. I do everything with it because I'm not very good with, what they call it like jewelry if i take it off just know it's going to be missing but apart from that like i can do everything with it i can wash with it i can literally do everything with it so i just turned back like <laughs> it was so funny i just turned back because i was facing i was looking at the shelf i was picking a little bit of sweet corn because i wanted to do something right i wanted to cook let me not say something i wanted to cook like when i come back and i needed sweet corn so i was picking sweet corn and some other things so i was faced like this at the shelf <laughs> i was faced like this at the shelf on my way back from work and i don't know yesterday <laughs> yesterday i was looking opo <laughs> and i faced what they call it me that usually i would just rub powder on my face just put lip gloss yesterday i took my time and did makeup and headed out i don't even know why i don't even pick up my camera yesterday to even do video but if i can insert a clip because i know i took a picture in the office i will insert a clip immediately i just turned i was like excuse me excuse me <laughs> excuse me married with two children please respect yourself <laughs> you guys uh, there's one thing that men think that we we don't get checked like we don't get tasseled up but anyways if, if you've experienced such as a married woman that is watching me let me know in the comment section but i decided to come and speak to you guys based on my post section you guys please watch out for my post section on cookie boomer that is my instagram handle watch out for it because i'm going to be asking questions again as regards to relationships and marriages in fact someone had even come into my dm to tell me that for the time that i give you know to like counseling people speaking to people based on this my relationship pool i should consider monetizing it and it got me thinking but that aside my poll section last week friday watch out for the one this friday it starts every friday by 7 pm so my last poll on friday i just said are you married yes is there one thing that you have learned over the years of your marriage that you wish you actually knew earlier and probably just say it say it to us let's know and a lot of people had this to say a lot of women had this to say which is and i would say it have a source of income have a source of income there are a lot of people that were saying your husband is is doing so well for himself and all yes that is very fine and very okay but also have no matter how little it is have source of income it was the thing that really really stood out for me and I know that there are people that are here as well. I, I am also of that opinion. I'm 100% I'm, I'm of that opinion, right? Have a source of income as well, right? Even if you're married to someone that takes 100% responsibility of everything, have your own source of income as well. Don't open your hands for everything, for pints, for this, for that. You open your hands, it's loving, it's caring. There's going to get to a part where the bills are going to choke and you'll be wondering what's happening, no matter how late it is. Especially for the fact that, you know, you're having children, your children are also looking up to you. Don't, don't also diminish your dreams. Apart from even children, don't also diminish your dreams. It's so easy. It's so easy. I tell you, you love that person. You get married. You start having children. 
it is so easy to lose yourself in marriage and motherhood it is so easy i mean with us too our physical dressings i used to be someone that loved to wear heels if i'm going from year to year i must put brown powder on my face make up everything i used to but now please give me my comfortable slippers give me my uh, gown free gown and i'm okay right but this is just something that was paramount that i was just saying let me come and share it here please have your own source of income before you actually venture into marriage i would love you guys to share your thoughts in the comment section but trust it you know even more people that have the opinion that you need to have your own source of income before you get married let me also know in the comment section you guys i want to wash kaima's hair right now right and actually just make it 